Hey chess lovers, welcome back to the chess yard. This is Therabaka and today I'll be showing you how to trap people with the London system. Now this was one of the interesting games that I just finished playing and I was playing as white and started off with d4. Open goes with knight f6, I play bishop to f4, open plays e6, standard moves in the opening, I respond with c3 trying to create a pyramid in the center is what the London system structure looks like. Urban plays bishop to e7, trying to develop the bishop, maybe preparing to castle. I play a knight to f3 first. Open goes castling. I play e3. Standard moves up till now. Open plays d6. I respond with a bishop to d3. That's where in the London probably your bishop lies, attacking the h7 always. Open goes with knight to d7, trying to connect both the knights. I went with queen to c2. Here my open plays c6. Uh, and now I try to pin the knight. Uh, doesn't actually work. There's nothing much pressure building up. But maybe I want to take this knight away and then grab the extra pawn. But both the knights are connected. Open plays uh, queen to c7 there. Uh, I can probably now sack the bish uh, bishop because after the opponent takes with the knight, I can always take the bishop. Uh, but here I took on the knight first. Open takes back. Uh, I went with knight to d2. Open plays e5, trying to break open the center. I take here, open takes back. And now comes knight to e4, trying to exchange the knights. Open does take, I take back with the bishop. And here my open plays f6, which is a mistake because now I can take on the h7. And after I do, open plays king to f7. Now I can give another check with the queen, uh, but then open can run over here. I thought, let me put my open king backwards there and then try to checkmate from the h file. Open goes back, and here I play queen to b3, giving a check first, pushing the opponent to the only legal square, which is h8. Open goes there, and now I play queen to a4. The idea is to swing over the queen onto h4, and then it's a checkmate from there on. Open sees that coming, plays pawn forward, uh, f5, which defends the h4 square, but I have already created a lot of weakness there. I now went with queen to c2. Open plays uh, pawn forward e4, trying to kick the knight. Knight now goes on to d4. And now I'm preparing to play queen on to e2 and then going to h5. Open plays bishop to c5, allowing me to play queen to e2. And now there's nothing much open can do. Open can try and push the king one step and then move the rook and then keep running in the game. But as you see, the engine evaluation is 8.6 already in favor of white. Open decides to take on the knight, that's mate in 2 now because queen h5 and then queen h7 is checkmate. Thanks to the bishop standing there, controlling the squares. Rook becomes the problem itself, not letting the king escape. Uh, so that's another problem. And that's why queen to h7 is a beautiful checkmate happening in 22nd move. I hope you enjoyed the video. Do let me know your feedback. Keep watching and sharing. Please do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already by now. And I shall see you tomorrow with some interesting and instructive content like always. Thanks for your time. Take care. Bye-bye.